Since the building technologies and systems were introduced in modern architecture, the usage and designs of environmental technologies and mechanical systems changed over time. Once it was used as a tool of an expression of a building, or concealed for a user's experience and building efficiency. As the development and evolution of systems are ongoing, where is it heading towards the future? Sea level rise is one of the best known of climate change's many dangers. The current sea level scenario points to a 64% risk of at least one foot over five feet taking place between today and 2050 in the Florida area. One of the coastline cities located in the Gulf of Mexico, Cape Coral features a tropical climate and ranks highest in the country for the number of properties with a substantial risk for flooding and by 2050, the prediction of the properties at risk will reach 97%. To minimize their area getting impacted by the risk of flooding from rising sea levels, houses are planned vertically in the future. Each of the program spaces are attached to the vertical core that is footed on the seabed, and these spaces are designed to sustain both under and above water level for flood resistance. Each of the spaces can rotate and move in both vertical and horizontal directions in response to the sun path for shading, as coastal areas lack natural shadings, and the spaces could split or merge to be used for different purposes. Residents will have total control over their kinetic house and choose how each space is programmed in any direction, under or above water. The ocean has vast resources that can help solve the complex problems coastal cities face. Cheap, abundant, clean, renewable energy from solar, wind, and waves make a sustainable house a better and clean place to live. Similar to the idea of the rotation of spaces that respond to the sun path, kinetic solar panels are designed to rotate and tilt to follow the path of the sun to maximize efficiency. Also, wind turbines are set on the highest level of the house that is operated by high offshore wind speeds that tend to be faster than the land. Building technologies and systems in the future are not leaning towards one side anymore, but becoming more flexible and humanized to suit different situations and climates.